What's going down, Death Stranding fans? Today, we're going to be looking at what's headed towards us, and it's going to be sailing across the beach very soon. Death Stranding got a brand new update. 1.13 is live. My name's Mac here at the MacGyver 7 channel, and today we're going to be ripping apart the mystery. What is inside the package of this update? So if you're new to the network, hit the subscription button and company with the notification bell, and get excited about what is going to be happening next. As we take a look over here, you can see that on the 24th, the update's going to go live. There's new missions, new delivery methods, upgraded melee, new weapons, you have a circuit, you also have a shooting range, SSD, performance 4K 60 FPS, you have fidelity and a native 4K, which is amazing, on top of what's going to happen for an ultra wide HD. On top of that, adaptive triggers for most people in 3D audio that will be accompanied inside of this golden, awesome update. But what is physically in it? And this is what we can take a look right over here. What they basically have put inside of here is additional to the save for the conversion. Um, they're going to have your PlayStation 4 can now export utilizing um, PlayStation 5 so you're able to export that to the PlayStation 5 you can open the cuff link in the menu while in step portions of the um, PlayStation 4 and deliver terminal select export data data cannot be exported while other uh, portions of um, if Sam's in orders yeah are in progress you really can't do it apparently so it's gonna be a little dicey so you might have to clean some stuff up before so complete any outstanding orders before exporting um, on top of that for as far as in order to load the export you will need to log into the playstation 5 account on the playstation network and then utilize the uh, used to create save data on playstation 4 let's go ahead and take a look at this real fast all you're gonna have to do is activate the save that you're in inside of there and then it'll be right over here inside of the system menu where you can just go ahead and select export the current save data and again make sure that you do have your orders cleared and as you can see on mine i have a lot so uh, it's going to be fun but for me i might just start the game over again or just clear out this and then go back and try to mop up a whole bunch of quests with the brand new playthrough once it's on a nice discount because i love the game i really do and i want to play it again uh, but it would be nice to see that during the holidays which i know they'll probably do so Go ahead and if you are newer to the network, go ahead and join, hit that subscription button. And um, if you are newer to the network, hit that notification bell as well. That way you can get all the future notifications that come across my channel in the near future. I'll see you guys and gals in the near future and I'm very excited to see this new DLC. I've got tons of updates it seems like that are flooded through that I need to catch up on and I am getting geared up for that and excited to do so. So see you guys and gals there.